everybody thank you for tuning back with us here on nintendo treehouse live with nintendo switch uh you know uh, my name is jc i'm here with uh you know i got smitty on my right and then to the right of him that's nate dog hi uh sorry we have nicknames uh, but before we begin um i just want to say thank you for everyone that's out there telling us that we have some stream issues we're totally working on that right now but we're going to keep plugging along so we're going to get right into the hardware and give you kind of an in-depth look at all the accessories all the hardware and again thanks guys appreciate keeping up with us man so uh yes and there's want a lot of hardware about? to cover this is a uh, yes. so many toys very versatile oh system. my gosh <laughs> yeah so exciting well let, can we start with this yeah, start you with want to? yeah yeah go ahead yeah this is uh this is empty, we've already unpacked it, but this obviously is what it's gonna look like right here. Oh God, just holding it fills me with <laughs> such lust. Um, Whoa, but okay. inside it is all this. So let's, uh, let's get to the good stuff. Yes, so first of all, you have the actual Switch console. This is our new home console from Nintendo. Uh, the Nintendo Switch. The camera over. Uh, this camera? <laughs> yes, there we go. Mm -hmm. it, uh, it is a beautiful piece of hardware. Um, it feels so good in the hand. Um, surprisingly thin, too. Yeah, surprisingly I, the thin. The first time we picked those up was like, oh, my. So it comes with uh, these Joy-Con controllers. And what you can do is slide these puppies in. Do you hear that? Click. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but it feels so good. Like, I could, this is, like, stressfully for me every day, all day. <laughs> I, I'm at my desk just doing this at work. Like, <laughs> I can lie to do that, too. <laughs> for hours. Uh, so you can pop these puppies on there. This allows you to control it in, uh, in handheld mode. And then once you have this dock connected to your TV at home, you can you know, go from playing in, in uh, handheld mode and pop it straight in there. Oop, that was backwards, was it? <laughs> no, that's right away. The there you go. Boom. And uh, there you have it. And yep. then it's on your TV, and now you're playing. Yep. And that's sort of the... Overview. I want to get down into like some of the little the little bits on this right. thing. Oh, do really it, quick, do it, do it if I can. So, um, first of all, you obviously want to. You can be playing digital games, but we have game cards for this system. So, um, and actually, can we? Is there something in there? Ooh, uh, I haven't even there? opened it, but there's something in here. So this is the <laughs> this, this is a game uh, box for what I'm going to be here. playing obsessively. Would you like to take a look at this? Here, this is Zelda. Let's get a close shot. up on that. Here, you want to want to hold the box too, so people can see what the box looks. Oh like? yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. Oh my. You gotta, uh, you obviously, you gotta flip it around, man. Oh. You gotta see the back. You see those contacts. They're so shiny. Ooh, shiny contacts. I'm gonna just blow on those real quick. Yeah, that's that's our Is old that, system. It's, you don't have to do it. Have to, have to <laughs> that's that's I, what I they know. took from the NES because they took something from every system. You know, right? <laughs> Bob it in, close it. Um, we, of course, uh, have the kickstand here, and I don't know if we actually mentioned this earlier, but this is actually where your micro SD card will go. So if you want to be right. starting. Oh, do we have one of those too? Here, yeah, check it out, dude, here. Take one I, of these. So terrifying. I don't know if you guys can see Thanks. the numbers on this uh, micro SD card. We have a 256 gigabyte don't, don't micro SD it, card. <laughs> it's like, Seriously, uh, I don't want to pop lose that in thing. there. Slide it right in. You have spot. storage forever, essentially. Yeah. <laughs> pop it in there. And of course, the kickstand works when you play this in right. tabletop mode. Well, and they put so much thought into the engineering of this thing. I mean, because you have the kickstand, it's already there. You might as well hide the, the SD card slot underneath that. Mm -hmm. Everything just is so well thought out. Yep, yep, yep. Um, and so we, uh, obviously, we just showed it the way you play it at home when you're docked. Right. Pull it out and play it on the go. Uh, it, when you're playing it in handheld mode, you know, you're whatever, sitting on the train, sitting on the plane, playing it like this. Um, what we're calling tabletop mode is when you are going to kick the kickstand out, mm -hmm. grab these, set them up. You know, to be honest, this uh, there's a number of ways that you can play this. I, I personally will play like this on a plane quite a bit, right. I think. But... Um, well, that's the way, like, with we, I'd just be on my couch, just kind of, like, full back. Lounge. Oh, yeah, lounge. it's all, <laughs> it's all back, man. Uh, but, of course, each of these are individual controllers, so, I mean, we could set this up, you know. Absolutely. And we're sitting next to each other on the train right. and jamming out. Right, and the right design here. of this thing is so that this kind of mimics, like, a SNES controller in that you have those same inputs, uh, you know, obviously, instead of a directional pad, we have a, uh, a analog stick now. Yep. But it's a... Uh, Clickable stick. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's a button. Right, right. And I think the first time, I mean, you got pretty big hands. I got sort of normal size hands. I think the first time we saw these were like, I was a little worried. It seemed like it was going to be small, but this is one of the reasons why it's so important that we have, you know, sampling going on where other people are out there playing it. We right. get to do some hands on here, mm -hmm. but it's really surprising when you get your hands on this it thing, is. sort of how comfortable it feels. It just kind of disappears into your hand. Yep. I mean, and the yeah, again, of your body yeah. at that point. That's Whether you're playing it like this or like this. Yeah. Right. It's so funny is you mentioned how it disappears your hand. Um, I don't know if you guys saw the thing for Switch. Uh, we, were, we were, I mean, Nintendo Switch, we did uh, ARMS, like, like last segment. And, like, I remember grabbing first time when I first played ARMS, and I started throwing punches, and I was like, that's great. And then, hey, uh, Bill looked over and said, how's it feel? I'm like, what? 
<laughs> yeah. I'm like, my, it's like the Joy-Con. I'm like, oh yeah, and I totally forgot I was holding them. Yeah. Like it just, yeah. yeah. So you'll you'll understand when you when you put it in your hands. And that that segment pointed out what I think is obvious to a lot of people by now. So accelerometers and gyrometers in both of these. So tilt control like this. If you're playing it like this, you're obviously gonna be able to do whatever you like. Um, I think we also have shown these as well. So the SR and the SL buttons are up here. So when you're playing this mode, like if you were playing, you know, like SNES style, as mm -hmm. you were talking about, those would be your shoulder buttons. Um, but the, uh, the the system also comes with um, these games, these straps, right? So uh, when you click these on, it, it's really, I mean, for safety's sake, obviously, you for want to wear this. But, um, <laughs> you know, you don't have to if you're if you're basically playing it without these buttons it really depends on your own comfort level like some people i think will want to play a lot of games without this because it just fits their hand better but for other people sliding the the wrist straps on will give them a little bit extra juice on top of this and it extends the the uh, l and r buttons up top so a little bit more comfortable like this these ones and i should point out these come with it uh we have some lovely colors here as well these are actually sold separately i love these colors <laughs> Yeah. They are extreme. Yeah. They're they're bright, man. Like if you take it even, you know, they're they're bright. They pop. <laughs> I mean, they do pop. I mean, it's right? like I don't think I've ever seen a physical object like that looks this bright. <laughs> it just like floods <laughs> my eyes with color, and I love it. Yeah. Um, and I love the finish on all of these. If you look at you know the actual the standard um, controllers, and then these, they all have this kind of matte finish, mm -hmm. which just looks sexy to be honest yep like it looks so good neon blue neon red mm -hmm. so again those will be those will be separate um and we also have maybe you should show that one too here i'll give oh, you i'll give you, you one of these well, but yeah go it. ahead no no you here i'll pop what? it down oh you got this, this guy this. what oh yeah yeah, 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 yeah. So oh, this ahead. yes this is the uh the wheel accessory um which you can also uh is also sold separately but you can also right. plug this in i don't know um how many people sort of I think that there are two camps from playing Mario Kart. Certainly, there were um, <laughs> in the uh, in the Wii era yeah. where uh, there were people who were absolutely devoted to normal controls, which is fine. There are people who got really excellent at motion controls and really loved it. I certainly did. Um, I personally like to finish races driving one-handed with uh, with my wheels, <laughs> just like this. And that's like why posted. you always came in eighth. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, 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 no. Not only in first. real life, but only in <laughs> first. Hand on 12, other hand in the air. Like. Anyway, this is obviously a little bit smaller than that, but still actually feels really, really this good. Is, and you have the L and R buttons as on well. On the back. That's so, um, again, so something. when you're Mario Karting, you can be tossing shells <laughs> out and... Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> it's funny, you know, they, and it's unfortunate that uh, you can play Splatoon. We play Splatoon too, like, mad with this thing. Sure. Um, and uh, it's excellent. There's also a, uh, a charging grip accessory that'll come as well that you can actually plug these into, plug like a spare set of Joy-Con right. into mm -hmm. and charge. Yeah, speaking um, of charging, we, we haven't actually, I guess, talked about all of this yet. <clears throat> we might as well. I mean, I think we're ready to talk about talking the Joy-Con controllers in depth. Mm -hmm. But these are constantly charging when they're attached to your Nintendo Switch system. Yep. So mm -hmm. it's kind of this, um, you never really have to worry about them running out of juice because they're kind of like passively charging every time you pop it in there. I mean, you don't have to think about it, which is super cool. Yep. Now this is, I, I love this thing. You know, I have to mention, speaking of uh, other features of that, one thing I really liked was when you had to use my system at work, mm -hmm. all you had to do to sync your pair of controllers <laughs> is you just went plunk and you popped them on, popped them off, and, and they're synced. synced. Yeah. They're done. That's it. Right, because you can actually connect, you know, a number of Joy-Con controllers to one one uh, switch system. Yep. And they will all sync the second you pop them in there like that. Yep. Yeah. Easy. Yep. Easy. So a couple things we, we still haven't covered. Uh, of course, the home button over here. Um, we have the capture button for capturing screenshots. And as we mentioned in the stream last night, eventually we'll be uh, capturing video as well um, to share online all of your exploits. Um, there's uh, the NFC reader is in the right Joy-Con. There's also, I don't know if you can see this. We got this in the camera. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That is the IR camera, um, and as Mr. Koizumi demonstrated last night, it, it basically can judge depth, it can judge sort of motion, um, it can judge JC <laughs> snacking on things that I think oh, we're going to oh, be showing a little bit later. Yeah. Um, but yeah. I'm really excited about uh, <laughs> the gameplay possibilities that are going to get unlocked with this. It's just yet another cool piece of tech that's in there that I think for a lot of people, you know, you, you get overwhelmed with the amount of information, the amount of tech that's in right. something, and you're... Hopefully, if you're like me, your mind sort of comes alive with the possibilities of what software developers 
will be thinking when they get their their hands on this stuff. They can like, how many ideas is this going to foment for them to um, to come out with great software for our system? So, right. fills me with excitement, and I'm glad that there are people much smarter than I am who are actually going to utilize these tools <laughs> to make awesome games for me to play. What's well, crazy thinking about how much tech is packed into just you know five inches or however big this thing is? It's like it's cr it's a technological marvel as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> Yeah, so don't lose it. Yeah. Yes, I'll yeah, do my seriously. best. Have to take, take good care. And, you know, in general, even, like, with the like with the console itself, the first thing when I picked it up was, like, this thing is thin, bro. <laughs> like, this thing is really, mm. like, it's, it's... It is thin. And there's a lot of it, right? But it's so sturdy. Like, I, you know, playing Splatoon, you know, on my Wii U gamepad, I would, you know, you get frustrated sometimes when your team isn't keeping up. And, <laughs> you know, you, you're, you're shaking. And, like, <laughs> this thing is right. so solid. I don't, I don't know if I could break this thing if I tried. I'm not going to try. Don't try.